Good morning, ladies and gentlemen of Fraserview River Middle School, th room 305, Division 1 and 3. Morning! Um, may the 4th be with you. <laughs> um, morning! Um, today is Monday, May the 4th, uh, Star Wars Day, for any of you that are interested. Uh, so, a few things to uh, start off with. Um, a number of you have submitted your um, English assignment on by Friday, which was awesome. Good job. Um, a few of you haven't, and a few of you have sent messages too because you submitted it, but you didn't give me access to it, so I can't actually see what you did. Um, but from those of you that did submit it, I wrote you a message at 1 a.m. on Friday night um, saying thank you. So thank you. Um, you brought a smile back to my face that hadn't been there in a long time. It's been something that I've been missing. Um, read every single word that I could. Um, read all the blogs, read the stories, watched all the videos, every single second of a video. There wasn't a second that I didn't watch. Uh, so thank you all for your effort that you put into that, um, your writing choice board assignments. It was great. You, some of you made me laugh. Um, some just made me smile, and a couple of you kind of made me cry, which is a good thing. It wasn't a bad cry. It wasn't like I was upset with the work that you did. It was just so proud you made me cry. So thank you. It was great. It was refreshing. It was something that I needed um, at that point in time. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, with that being said, moving on. So. What we have is, would you rather have a fruit bowl or a smoothie? Fruit bowls won by a hair. Um, don't know why, but fruit bowls won by a hair. A number of you need to start working on your arguments and your support, your evidence. So please take a look at the feedback that I provided the entire class. I provided you all with the same feedback on this one. Um, please take a look at that feedback. I really do want you to try to start um, explaining yourself, supporting yourself, and strengthening your arguments. Um, in a two or three weeks' time, you'll be having to really persuade me. Um, but being able to persuade me um, can also bode well for you on your final reflections and your assessments. So please do that. Um, today it's a normal day. You Monday you have your table group chats. Oh, not so normal. Table group chats is the normal part, but you're now moving into um, the Google Meet. So please go into Google Meet to do that. Um, I will link a video um, in class stream that will show you that as well of how to do that. That's at 10.30. 10.45, you have your table group chat challenge starting off of the week. Today is just step one, and I think step two. You're going to be getting some of it later this week. I just want to make sure that we're all starting off on the same foot and to give you all time to catch up to each other. So check out your table group challenge for the week. Um, the first little bit's released today. The next part of the challenge will be released Wednesday morning. Um, other than that, you have your typical work time, independent work time for myself, Mr. O and Mr. Kolish, Mr. Matthews. And one more thing, you get a new English assignment today. Yay, English. Um, today you're gonna to be starting your themes um, in literature. I'm happy for it. I, that doesn't make any sense. I'm happy with it. I hope you enjoy it. It will take some time and it is due on Friday, like this Friday. So make sure you do it. Make sure you plan your time accordingly. Take a look at the approximate times that are given to you so you know how to structure and balance your time on this one. Um, I will be holding a class um, discussion for Division 1 and 3 tomorrow, that's Tuesday, um, at 11 a.m. to help walk you through it if you need it. Um, beforehand, though, make sure you look at it. Don't wait for tomorrow. Look at it today. Try it today. Come to me tomorrow at 11 a.m. for a whole class discussion on it. Yeah. What do you do this weekend? Hands up if you had a nap. I didn't have a nap. 
Hands up if you slept in. I didn't sleep in. Hands up if you got dressed on Saturday. Yeah, I can do that. I slept in. I got dressed on Saturday. Hands up if you got dressed on Sunday. Me, sort of. I got dressed at like 5 p.m. for dinner. Yeah, 5 p.m. for dinner. We had a fancy Nancy dinner party here last night. Um, complete with parfaits because, you know, that's a fancy way of saying Sunday in French. <laughs> Just really want to share part of my life with you because I miss it. I miss you all. Um, so that's all there is for today. Hope you have a good day. Division 3, see you at a 1 p.m. today for a class meeting. Hope. Fingers crossed. Um, 1 p.m. today for class meeting today, Division 3. Otherwise, we'll see you all tomorrow morning. Bye.